CityWise is a voluntary organisation providing educational support to young people who come from socially disadvantaged backgrounds. I'm here at their centre in Jobstown Tower to find out more. CityWise is an educational project that caters for young people from socially disadvantaged backgrounds, uh, um, after school and out of school type projects. Uh, we have centres in Dublin, which will be the main operation, you're sure in here, in Jobstown. We have another centre in Ballymun. Uh, we have a smaller centre in Belfast, in uh, Balnacarrickie, Westmead, and in Limerick. Uh, the object of what the centre is in all locations is the same, to help young people to get the most out of their education and to take education more serious. Ryan, how long have you been here at CityWise? Uh, this is my first year, this is September. Since September, and um, what kind of things do you do here on a day-to-day -day basis? You're studying for your junior search. Yeah, everything around the school does, like, do uh, classes, subjects like uh, home ec, science, maths, geography, English. How is it different from your other school, from your school before here? So it's not like, you don't, if you got, like in my old school, I got a bad start, like, but this school doesn't look at that, you get me? You look past that and just give you a fresh start. And you do loads of activities yeah, every Friday and everything we go here. What kind of things do you do here? Uh, you go uh, arm, it's, 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 the DJ comes in and he does the helps us out to the stores, how to like, use it and all. That's pretty cool. Uh, What's your favourite thing about being here at CityWise? Everything, getting to do junior search. Uh, everything is just super deadly. Like. What are you going to do after you're finished in this programme? We're leaving search. And, uh, just, I'm going to try to be a DJ. So you know how much I need you, but you never even see me to you. Everybody seems to um, res have responded really well to the, the different environment. How is it different from regular schools in terms of the activities and, and the setup here? Um, it's just, um, well, I suppose the mid school way, we deal with things differently. Um, so classes in the morning time be 40 minutes, I suppose the same as a mainstream school. Then they have a break for 10 minutes and then the two classes in the afternoon are 35 minutes. So they do different activities. Um, and because it's a small number, you know, in a group, then there would be in mainstream schools, you'd have a chance to give them like a reward class, you know, something to build up to, you know, so um, including myself, a lot of the staff do it, maybe every five classes, if the five classes have gone really well, the sixth class then could be a reward class. And that could be a number of things, it could be, you know, to play pool up in the pool room, it could be computers, it could be to watch a DVD, anything like that. So they're working towards something. And how important do you think um, an organisation like CityWise is in areas um, like where you've got disadvantaged communities? Oh, it's fantastic because like everyone deserves a second chance and this programme proves that. You know, that they dropped out of school but mid-school are giving them a second chance and it's working. Like mid-school have a 100% pass rate in the junior search, which is amazing. You know, for only doing morning classes, you know, for classes stopping at 25 to 1, to have a 100% pass rate, brilliant, really, really good. Well, what's your role here at CityWise? Uh, my main responsibility is uh, I manage the mid-school programme. Uh, mid-school is an uh, educational programme for teenage boys who have dropped out of mainstream school. And they come here for their, their, their education up to junior cert. So how would the mid-school programme differ for, from a mainstream school? Well, it differs in a few ways. I suppose the first thing that the, the students notice is they don't have to wear a uniform. Um, and so that's one of the, the big problems in school, you know, and so uh, it, it, it makes it different. Um, it's a shorter day as well, they finish at one o'clock. Um, and uh, I suppose the approach, um, when they spend a few days here, they see the approach from the staff and the overall atmosphere is very different to school. I mean, our objective is that it's a very warm and friendly atmosphere and they have breakfast with the teachers, they have lunch with the teachers. Um, and uh, 
we try and, and uh, make it as relaxed and informal as possible. Um, whereas in the classroom, it's very similar to school in a lot of ways in that they, they do the same subjects and um, they do the same exams. Jonathan, why did you come to CityWise? When I was in first year, it was a bit of a mess and kept on messing school. Kept on fighting a lot, so I got kicked out. Like, that's when I got kicked out. I was out of school for a little while. That's when I used to go to a club. That's when my youth worker told me about CityWise, so I came in for an interview. Then I met Paul and all that, other leaders in the school. Got to go, started going to work and all. That's when I got to know it. That's when, because when you come down to CityWise, if you're in first year or second year, if you're in third year, you get put back here. So all the, all the subjects and studies you've missed, you can do them over and get prepared for your juniorship. So like I started studying and all, started coming in studying. Uh, like there's loads of groups and all. Came in, got studying now, I'm doing my mocks. I'm nearly leaving and I have, you have a choice whether you can go back into school or youth reach or you can go to Rising. That's only up in Georgetown as well, like, do you know what I mean? So you're studying for your junior cert now here in CityWise. How is this different from your last school? How does it differ? It's different because when you come in here, like you get breakfast jamming, you get breakfast and you get lunch in a normal school, you barely get that. And uh, the classes, like the teachers, the teachers listen to you. Like in some other schools, some teachers don't listen to you, they want you to listen to them all the time. Like everyone's friendly and like we all get rewards, like I mean, if all the students are, do their work and do good every Friday, they get to go on a trip, like or the, get to go on a trip or every Wednesday sometimes. We go to the library, pick out any book we want or research, that's when we come back to the school. That's how different this, like, we think it's actually better than school. Last year, uh, I realised when I came here just how important a place like this is. I taught in a fee-paying boarding school for 35 years. I now see a very, very different type of uh, situation. But it's enormously important for an area that hasn't got the advantages of the, the place where I taught. That there is a resource as fine as CityWise for them to use.